Hey everyone, welcome to Life of Twee. My new thing for the week, it's something that I've been wanting to try to do for a while now. It's to make pho. For those of you that don't know, pho is a staple Vietnamese food. It is delicious. It is a beef broth. It's got noodles, a bunch of different toppings and fresh herbs. Oh my goodness. If you've ever tried pho, you know what I'm talking about. Just smelling that, that broth right away. Oh my gosh, there's so much depth to it. It's, it's so delicious. Um, I'm surprised that I haven't tried to make it sooner, but um, it's one of those things where it just seems really tedious. There's a lot of ingredients that go into it. it you have to simmer the bones for a while. It's just, you know, but um, obviously it's gonna be worthwhile. So my first time making it, I know that I can tweak it once I've made it a few times to my preference, to my liking. So we'll see how it turns out. If any of you, by the way, have any um, ideas, suggestions, if you have questions about the ingredients, just uh, comment below and I'll try and answer them to the best of my ability or I'll find out, I'll look it up for you. I wish you could smell my house right now. It smells so good. I can't believe it. Like it actually really does smell like I'm making pho. The smell of raw onions, the herbs, this broth. Oh my goodness. Ready to try this? Let's do it. How does, Gross. how does this place smell, first of all? Does that smell good? It's like a Vietnamese restaurant. <laughs> Not as much yelling. Nice. Bean sprouts, got the Thai basil, got your wedge of lime. Vietnamese dish and Thai basil. I don't know why it's called Thai basil. Maybe it's very prominently known in Thailand. I don't know. But uh, you don't use this, right? You gotta have some sriracha. Come on. No, you don't need sriracha. I love... If it's good, you don't need sriracha. I love the smell, the garlicky flavor of sriracha and traditional hoisin sauce. It has a little bit of sweetness. I might just add a little bit before. Um, off to the side. If, if, by the way, if it's not salty enough, 
that can be easily remedied. You could also add more fish sauce or a pinch of salt if you need it. But um, I like to make mine more like on the not as much salt side because other people's um, preferences could be different. How is it? It's, um, it's very good. <laughs> yeah, from my first try? Yeah. Okay. Were you, are you like surprised or something? <laughs> No, I, well, I mean, not really, but at the same time, yeah, I am. Why is that? Because it's, this is hard to make. Right, you, you saw all the steps that go into it and all the ingredients, obviously. So, do it right. You gotta get a little bit of everything in your spoon. You gotta get your piece of beef. You gotta get the noodles. You gotta get the herbs. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot yeah, to think about. I'm a bigger spoon. It's not that bad. <laughs> wow, I'm really surprised I made it. Yeah, I probably add like a little bit of fish sauce to it because um, it needs a little bit more salt, but again, that's so easily remedied. And as to true Vietnamese fashion, you gotta do the slurp. Mm -mm. You gotta do the slurp. <laughs> no slurp. This is fantastic. See you next time.